ideal resident for our program is somebody who is interested in the academics that's available at a university-based residency program, but still has a very strong interest in just being a general OBGYN in private practice and wants to learn how to do that in a real community setting with a wide variety of patients. I think that you get a good mix of having an academic institution along with a community hospital feel. So you get all the good teaching, but it still is kind of that community hospital feel. Now that we're affiliated with Oakland University's medical school, we definitely get the benefits of having a wonderful library, electronic resources right at our fingertips, and so that really helps in getting answers and furthering our education very quickly. During the first year, we start off with a lot of the basic rotations. Um, we spend two months on labor and delivery, strictly doing deliveries, vaginal deliveries and C-section. Then we have a couple months of gynecology rotation as well, where we do a lot of the basic surgeries as first years. But we also have office time, clinic time, where we get to see our patients for a myriad of problems that they might have, not only throughout their pregnancy, but just outside. A lot of women will see their OBGYN as a primary care doctor as well as for their OBGYN needs. So it's really important to have that background um, of just the basic primary care. I think Beaumont's unique in that we're given a lot of autonomy, um, both from the faculty and from the private physicians. So I think being a resident here, you, uh, you're allowed to grow up a lot faster and uh, to get a lot more uh, education in that respect. You will get exposure to everything. You'll get very comfortable doing, um, taking care of high-risk patients, a busy service. Um, you'll have, and then you'll have all of the exposure to all of the subspecialties that you need, it's including maternal fetal medicine, urogynecology, reproductive endocrinology. So our typical day at Beaumont starts uh, with rounding on our patients from the days previous. If we're an OB, we go uh, and deliver patients, both complicated and, and normal, as well as operative deliveries and highly advanced C-sections. And for GYN, we do a myriad of cases, including um, vaginal hysterectomies, laparoscopic hysterectomies, and minor cases, including uh, dilation and curettage, ESHER, and laparoscopies. So this patient was admitted overnight. She is 35 and 6 7 weeks. I think uh, the biggest strength of our program is just the closeness and camaraderie of our residents um, amongst themselves as a, as a group. Uh, I think the, uh, the atmosphere and uh, the environment, the people in general, uh, was what really drew me to Beaumont here. Uh, after I did my residency interview here, uh, I really fell in love with the people and the environment how well they got along and uh, the camaraderie that everybody seemed to have. We're all really close to each other, we're really good friends, we do things with each other outside of the hospital. There's great restaurants, there's nice sports arenas to go watch a game, and then just outside of Detroit too, there's some great small cities that have a very nice community feel where you can go and take a walk in one of the beautiful parks or a bike ride. Uh, there's a lot of sports teams that a lot of people get behind. Uh, there's a lot of culture and a lot of history here. If you want the whole package where you want to be a part of an academic setting. You'll feel supported while you're here um, and you'll have kind of the opportunities to try and um, test your own skills, learn more, try your own plans of care for things. But still know that you're going to get a one-on-one -on -one education. It is a warm environment to learn a, to complete a very hard task which is residency. Then you can really have it all and I think that Beaumont will provide that.